guys welcome to the tarot goddess this reading is on Nicki minaj and cardi b um there is a lot of um anger between the both of them it seems like they're going at it with each other um using different subliminals on the internet i do see that they have a lot of anger towards each other as well it seems like um nikki is very upset with cardi b over something that was said so it created a lot of um animosity um anger between the both of them i don't see them moving on behind this it seems like this is going to be an ongoing situation until someone apologizes um i do see that Nicki minaj is tired of the, everyone trying to come at her and say things about her which is not even true because previous in the previous um years she had to deal with so much backlash and people making stories up on her about drug use so now it's it seems as if you know nikki when she stands back from the spotlight just a little bit it seems like people just try to take a further leap by trying to hurt her and um nikki is a strong person nikki minaj is very strong-minded she's she can stand on her stand on what she means and what she says she doesn't allow people to just run all over her now as far as with cardi b it seems like cardi b has been having a lot of anger with her so i am picking up a lot of animosity you know it was things that was said a couple of years ago which is still dragging till the present year which is 2022 and it seems like they're not over it it's like it's still going on and it seems like it's still tension between the both of them which it is because things were just said over the internet but what i am going to tell you is that i do see that nikki has a vision nikki wants to move forward in her life she just wants people to leave her name out of all the bullshit nikki is very strong she's very strong-minded and also cardi b is very strong-minded so you got two strong rappers in the industry women rappers in the industry that are really having a lot of animosity towards each other so it gets kind of crazy because it's not just between them two you have other people in the industry too that is getting in the middle of it okay it seems like people are instigating this by rivalry and um yeah and it's like it's ridiculous on both parties but what i am picking up is that cardi is upset cardi feels like she's been disrespected and it all boils down to someone's he say she say okay so i am getting a lot of tension between not just only Nicki minaj on cardi b side on her part it's also other industry people that cardi b is getting sick of as well so i am pulling up a lot of tension with cardi b it's not due to jealousy it's more so of what's being said okay all right you do have to be mindful of what you say and we all know cardi b she speaks her mind okay as you can see but even though she speaks her mind it seems as if she hurts a lot of people okay her career is looking great but she's also jeopardizing her career because she's causing business relationships to end quickly with her and this is not looking good because business relationships are ending with her because it's, she's not going to see growth if she continues with being upset and angry with the wrong people okay sometimes you have to be mindful of what you say and we all know that cardi b is not mindful of what she says um i do see that Nicki minaj just wants to move forward she just wants to make her money and you know be able to entertain okay her barbs and it seems like every time she's on this journey this path of just being keeping to herself and minding her own business and just being positive it seems like someone always comes at her just to tick her brain and to trigger her into getting upset but see what anyone know what no one knows about Nicki Minaj is that Nicki Minaj knows a lot about a lot of people and um she's not the type to run her mouth but she will um blow your ass up <laughs> okay if you piss her off so it seems like Nicki is not taking no shit anymore she has too many people that are hating on her so now it's time for her to move forward and it's time for her to open up a lot of can of worms I'm telling you and that's what I'm getting to as well I do see as far as with her love life it seems like things is not really looking great with the love life um i am getting um 
the drama that's on the outside of her home, her relationship with, with other celebrities is kind of coming into the household. So, you know, it seems like her, her baby daddy is like getting sick of everyone picking on his baby mama, Nicki Minaj. He's getting really pissed off. So it's like Nicki has to calm her baby daddy down from knocking someone out. And that's what I'm mainly getting over here. Um, It seems like he's a very feisty man and he will do anything to protect his baby mother and his child. So they better leave Nicki Minaj alone and stop picking on her um I do see they're very guarded okay they're very guarded and protected especially emotionally and physically okay but as far as with um Cardi B it seems like Cardi B has a lot of um haters on her part as well um like I said I'm getting more so of two people that are kind of going back and forth between Nicki and Cardi relaying information so I am getting a lot of back and forth you know people being two-faced and messy and um hopefully Nicki Minaj and Cardi B can sit down and try to make make sense of all of this but I don't think so because words have been said things have been said it's already starting up but what I'm looking at right here I do see eventually they will end up talking about this but not now <laughs> I do see eventually they will end up confronting each other in privately <laughs> not in the public's eye but i do see eventually they will um make amends okay later on down the line um it's just that you know some you like i said you have two of these beautiful rappers women that are just going in the same direction as far as with their career and it seems like so many people are just whispering things in everyone's ears and all this negative energy around the both of them you know it seems like it's 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 invading their career it's, it's sabotaging relationships with business partners and hopefully this can get better because i don't see it getting better i see it getting worse until Nicki minaj and cardi b can actually sit down as civilized grown women and talk to each other and try to figure it out okay they don't have to be the best of friends and i don't see them be the, being the best of friends but i do see one day they will end up getting together and just you know having a, a real adult conversation um i do see it will be a long time before that actually happens but yeah i do see eventually they will get to the bottom of what is going on um with this um gossiping because this is really crazy um this is actually interfering with both of their careers um, it's also coming into both both of their household, the drama, because you have Cardi B that's upset. You know she's talking to her her family, and Nicki Minaj is talking to her family, and it's just like everyone is ranting and raving and, you know, just trying to figure it out and trying to figure out who's lying and why is this being said. And like I said, I just feel like both parties need to grow up, but eventually they are going to see it that this is very immature and like i said everyone in the industry and every everyone like all their fans also thought they made amends but <laughs> i don't think so i think they just need to sit down and that's what i'm picking up i'm seeing them actually gonna face off uh and and make amends and, and you know it will be a great journey for the both of them do i see them being friends i don't see that i don't see them being the best of friends and it's so sad because they're both from New York City. And it's like whether they're from different boroughs, they're still from New York City. And, you know, they're supposed to be representing from New for New York City in general. And but like I said, <laughs> when there's tension, there is tension with the Barb and Cardi B. <laughs> OK, so hopefully this tension can be resolved and, you know, both parties can look at it and just laugh years from now and say, you know what? We were being very immature. <laughs> so with that being said, I hope you enjoyed this reading. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell. And I will see you guys soon. Bye. <laughs>